Hello and welcome to our YouTube channel. So in this video, we are going to understand the demonstration of ECG classification or particularly speaking classification of PVC bit in the ECG signal uh, using the temporal features. So as far as the PVC is concerned, it is all about the premature ventricular contraction and it is one of the uh, abnormalities in the heart disease. So whenever you want to detect the heart disease of the patient, then this kind of uh, abnormality can be considered. If this is detected, then definitely there are chances of heart disease. Now, for this purpose, we'll be using the data set of ECG signal. We'll process that ECG signal and using that, we'll be detecting whether that is normal bit or it is PVC bit. And if it is PVC bit, then definitely there are abnormalities in the heart. So we are having data set uh, in the form of Excel sheet where all the signals or the bits are or their values are stored. Now what we will be doing, we will train the model convolutional neural network first of all. We will convert all those data into the graphical format or the image format. And then we will train the convolutional neural network model on that. And after that we will be diagnosing the disease. Now for example, we are having different sets of fusing uh, ECG bits which will look like this one similar to this one then uh, we are having the normal ECG bit which generally looks like this and then we are having the PVC ECG bit which looks like this so our objective is to identify which is normal which is abnormal for that we are having this data set and uh, basically the samples are stored in the raw data.xl file here all the signal values are stored now once the code is running this is basically a python implementation and the deep learning or the machine learning algorithms we are using here and in order to create a gui or the web application we are using the flask framework of python and now let's see after running the code we can open the application then we need to type the username and password so it is admin admin once you log in it will redirect to this page and then here you need to put the sample number for example if i put five as a sample number then it will load that sample and this is clearly abnormal ECG, PVC ECG detected, which is abnormal. For example, if you detect right 512 number of sample, then that sample will be fetched from the uh, memory and whether it is normal or abnormal, that is detected. Okay, so different, different samples you can pick. So this is the normal ECG we can consider. And uh, we can actually uh, find out whether that is a normal ECG or abnormal. Now it's PVC ECG. So total we are having 1800 samples of the ECG signal and which is classified in three different categories normal PVC and the fusion ECG which detects the abnormalities in the ECG signal. So in case you need the complete code of this particular project and the guidance for the step-by-step -step implementation of this particular project then uh, you can check out the description box under this video. Thank you.